So you guys, I did some organizing. I put my books from the previous um, video. So I arranged my books. I have a lot of space on the bottom for more books. Just kidding, but it is there. <laughs> I put up my halloween -y stuff. I did it over here too. It's nice to have the dressers because then I can hide stuff in the drawers. <laughs> and I also cleared up this mess here. So I have some junk there. I gotta figure out where, to, where, where I'm gonna put it. But this part is the section where I wanna put like a couch or a chair or a love seat or something maybe in that corner and move that bookshelf over a little bit more. I don't know, I haven't decided yet, but something is gonna go there, like some cor some kind of a love seat, because there is there is space. Um, and then I have the other bookshelf right here with all of my other Halloween-y stuff. So yeah, really happy. My bookshelf is organized too. <laughs> really happy about that. Um, I like the way it came out. The room is cozy. Um, and yeah, so. Hi guys, Rose here. So I am going to be doing a fall haul. And I thought while I was going to film this as a separate, um, <clears throat> as a separate video, I think I'm just going to combine it with my video diary. So, um, yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm going to do. I think that'll be like the easiest thing to do. Um, okay. So I have quite a bit of things. You've probably seen some of it <laughs> if you follow me on Instagram, but I thought I would just bring it all out. Um, so I went, I did a little bit of fall shopping um, yesterday, and then I also did some like maybe two weeks ago, a week or two ago, I don't know. And so I just thought I would show you guys what I got from the week or two ago as well. Um, so let's start with that. Let's start with, um, Let's start with that. Let's start with, let's start with the two weeks ago. Okay, so I went to Michael's. Um, Michael's is a, so I'm from California, for those of you guys who are new to my channel. I'm from Southern California, and in California, we have a Michael's. It's a craft store. I don't know if they have them in all of the states. I don't know, but that's where I went, just so you guys know, <laughs> if you're curious. Um, and Michael's always has coupons. So if you just Google Michael's coupon or if you're subscribed to their um, their rewards program or whatever, you'll get coupons for the store. And they're really good coupons. It's usually like 40 or 50. Sometimes you get a 50% off, but it's usually a 40% off a regular price item. Um, or sometimes they do like 40% off your entire purchase. Those are rare, but I have gotten one or two of those. Um, sometimes it's like 20% off, whatever. There's all, they always have a coupon. So if you're going to go to Michael's, make sure you Google their coupons and then snap a photo of it. So you have it on your phone so that when you are standing in line to make your purchase, you can also save some money. <laughs> I love coupons. So I went specifically for this guy. So they have their, um, Halloween stuff out and one of my, one of my, favorite people I follow. Her name is um, Jessica and she goes, or I think it's, she goes by Jess, mostly Jess or sometimes Jessie. Um, <clears throat> but she has, um, it's black, black cats and cards. Black cats and cards. <laughs> Girl, leave a comment in this video so that people can see your, your, your stuff and then go subscribe to her YouTube channel too. But she was the one that posted the photo of the skeleton that is a meditating. And I was just like, oh my God, I need to have him. So as you can tell, he's a very pretty generous size of a skeleton. Um, he's not that heavy, but he's pretty decent. Like he's, he's a, he's good. He's not like cheap plastic or anything like that. Like he's, he's really good. Um, I love him all of the detail. He has tons of detail. He has tons of even in the back. I mean, so much detail. And I just love that he's in this uh, meditation pose. <laughs> and Jessica had a picture of him with um, holding crystals in his palms. Like she put little crystals in his hands. And I was just like, oh my God, I need to have one so that I could copy you and do the same thing. 
So anyways, I have him on my reading table and I've been placing my, um, my amethyst crystal in his lap. So I don't know, I might switch it out. Maybe I'll put something else there, but I thought he was so cute. So he's the one that I used the coupon for. And I actually went to Michael's twice. So the, the, the first time I went was for a different product, which I'll show you next. Oh, Starla. And, um, and then I came a second time with another coupon on a different day because you could only use it once, I believe, for one, like, for per transaction. Um, and I got him. So <laughs> I used my 40% off, so he was pretty much half off. Um, I believe he was priced at $24, but I got him for $11, $11.12, something like that. So super good deal. Um, so that's my meditating skeleton. Freaking love him. Um, okay, so the other thing that I bought at Michael's on a separate on a separate trip because I wanted to use the 40% off coupon is a pillow and I freaking loved it when we went my husband and I were just kind of browsing and I fell in love with the pillow I was like oh my god I love it it's the hand and and the palmistry hand and it's just so cute so I use my coupon for this and I have it on my couch along with the other pillows I have on the couch and it's just a cute little, like a cute little accent piece to put on your couch if you're like into that stuff. <laughs> so I loved it. I love the pillow and I got it for 40% off. Um, I think, how much was the pillow? I don't even remember how much he was. Maybe 15 bucks and then so I got half off. I don't know. I don't remember the pillow price. But I just remember I was super excited because to get pretty much half off on something like that is like, I'll do it. <laughs> they have other pill pillows too that are super cute, but I don't, you know, you can only use one coupon for one item. So I'm just like, I'm not going to go too crazy. So another thing I bought from Michaels is a tumbler. So I really, really, really wanted something to carry my iced teas in. I get a lot of iced teas from Starbucks on my way to work. That's just the thing I do. Um, and so instead of carrying like the Starbucks thing, <laughs> I've been carrying it in a tumbler and I think it's the cutest thing. Um, so it comes with a little straw and it's pretty large. So a venti will fit in here. Um, give or take sometimes depending on how much ice they put in the venti. Um, so if I pour it myself, I can get all of the liquid in there and I don't put all of the ice that they put it because you know Starbucks jacks up all of the ice and less liquid. So um, if I pour it myself, then I can usually get the entire venti in here. Um, I think a Trenta would probably fit in here if you didn't really have much ice. So depending on if you like your drinks cold or not. Um, but I usually order a venti iced tea and then I'll pour it in here and it fits and it's just perfect. So it's so cute. It's like glitter detail and it has little, um, we have little skulls and pumpkins and spiders and ghosts and bats and stars. So super cute. Love the tumblers and they have so many of them, but I just really like that one cause it was blingy and I'm like, yeah, that's too, totally cute. Hey, stop chewing on mommy's stuff. Oh my gosh, she's bad. <laughs> um, Okay, I'll show you the candle because I bought a candle from Michaels too, but I'll show it to you with the, all the candles. I'll just keep everything like kind of in order because I'm anal like that. Okay, so the other place that I went to is um, the, oh, I forgot another thing. Dang it, I hate when I do that. Oh my gosh, okay. I'll be right back. Get a little dark. <laughs> so hopefully it won't be annoying on the video. Okay, so the other place that I went to, Starla. Oh my God, I'm like two seconds away from kicking her out of the room. Um, the other place I went to is the 99 cent store. <laughs> so 99 cent store has the best, um, <coughs> the best Halloween decor. I was very impressed. I don't usually go, I don't usually do 99 cent store. I usually do Dollar Tree um, because I just always live closer to the Dollar Trees than the 99s, and so I never really went to the 99. But I wanted to go to the 99 because they specifically have, <laughs> and my coworkers will be laughing if they're watching this, but the 99 has specific, like, they have some Mexican candies, and they have, like, 
this tamarindo one that is like so good it's like chili with tamarindo and so we like to eat it at work and the 99 seems to be the only place that has it and so i went to the one up here where i live and they had it so i was like hell yeah <laughs> and then of course you know if you see the halloween decor out you can't if you're like if you're a halloween lover you can't just walk by it like you have to go look at it so i looked and i found some cute stuff so what i bought was this cute little mug actually it's not little it's a big ass mug <laughs> but it's a little dia de los muertos skull i freaking loved it so they had them in black and then they also had the white i got the white one because i like the way white looks in my house um i have a ceramic owl that's kind of like an off-white color i just like the way it looks on the countertop i think it looks really pretty and i thought the white would look really pretty if i were to put a succulent in here so because i'm all about the plant life right now <laughs> i just thought this would be the cutest little plant life like succulent ca um candle holder oh my god succulent vase um so i'm definitely going to be putting a little baby in here um once i find one but yeah so super cute i really loved it thought that was just like the cutest thing um i also picked up this pumpkin so i really 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 love pumpkins um because you could put them out for october and then you can also leave them out through uh thanksgiving like thanksgiving november <laughs> because november is like fall season um and so i really like pumpkins and dollar tree because i shop at dollar tree dollar tree has these really cute um i guess they're ceramic they're not glass um i guess it would be ceramic i don't know but they have all of these cute pumpkins and i have them all throughout my room so you can see them up there um different colors different styles and dollar tree has them right now so <laughs> I was that girl that was like going through and buying one of each design because I just thought they were so cute and I've heard that they have blue ones right now and I'm like oh my god I need to go so I might be doing that tomorrow <laughs> but anyway so I have these little pumpkins and I didn't buy these this year but they do have them so I thought I would show you guys so they have some like this they have some with like design and then they have like other colors. They have white, I have a greeny one, I have oranges, different ones, but they're so cute if you group them together because it just kind of goes and it's so cute. Like it's a cute way to do some decor and you could keep it up through November because it's not just Halloween. So you could keep them up through November and you don't have to worry about putting them, taking them down, you know, because that's kind of annoying. It's fun to put decorations up, but I hate taking them down. <laughs> so that's kind of cool because it's like you could you could put it up now and keep it up for three months and it works um and then so this was the one that i got at the 99 cent store so these are at dollar tree and i think the 99 had some similar to this but i i don't i don't know i don't want to say for sure but um, when i saw this one i was like he is so cute so i just love the spiky detail so i bought him and i have him on my um my kitchen table like my the island in the kitchen where the owl is I have him here and then I have like a ceramic pumpkin with him so super cute it just looks totally cute um so there's that another 99 cent store purchase now this is more like Halloween decor um because I don't really have much of my own stuff right now but I'm gonna start building up to it so this is another 99 cent purchase. This one is actually $1.99. So I was surprised 99 cent store has like stuff that's not just 99 cents. I didn't know that. Like I said, I don't really shop at 99. Usually it's just the Dollar Tree. But they had cute little decor. So I thought this was cute. It reminded me of Starla. It's actually as big as Starla. It's kind of funny. <laughs> but it's a little kitty and made out of garland. And she has little eyes and a nose and whiskers. And I love the purple, so they had black, they had purple, they had silver, and I think that's it. And so I got the purple one because I figured this one will like stand out the most. So I'm thinking of putting this one out in front of one of the windows, um, like from the inside though. But I don't know, we'll see how, what I do. But I just thought this cat was so cute and it stands up on its own. So freaking love it, he's so cute. And 
Another purchase is these hands, these little witchy hands, which Starla has already started to nibble on. She's so bad. Um, so when I saw these, my husband was like, nah, I don't want to do that. And I'm like, I'm doing it. Sorry. <laughs> I think it's cute. So it comes with these like pointy stick thingies and you stick them in the ground. So it looks like which hands are popping up out of the ground. I freaking love that because in my front yard, we have a little sago palm. And so I figured um, in the little rock garden that's right there, I'm going to just kind of dig these into the dirt and um, put them up. So I think they're cute and they'll glow in the dark. So I don't know. I just like that. I thought that was so funny. Super cute. Um, sorry, guys. I'm trying to like reach everything. Another thing I got at the 99 cent store is these cute little kitty cat oven mitt things. So there's this a pot holder with little cats, orange and black. And then I also got an oven mitt. I only got one oven mitt because you really just need one for one hand. And then if you have this in the other, you can kind of grab it. <laughs> but it's so cute. So it's a little black and um, orange oven mitt little Halloweeny cats so I got that for 99 cents uh, the other thing I got the other thing I got is this cute little scarecrow pumpkin face so this one was one of those this one was 3.99 I don't even know if that was what they charged me for it but he was labeled as 3.99 but he's so cute so he stands on his own and he has a little pumpkin face and I love the little sunflower on his hat and I thought he was so cute. It gets really windy up here by my house because we live in the desert. So I was like, can't put him outside. But um, I do have him in my entryway. Like when you walk into my house, he's right there. And I already scared myself with him <laughs> last night when I was turning off the lights in the house to go to bed. And I see this little thing standing there. Like it, it did startle me. So now that I know he's there, he's not going to scare me anymore. But... <laughs> <laughs> I did spook myself, but I thought he was so cute, you guys. So um, I bought him, and I just love it. The cats were like so, like, what the fuck is that? But <clears throat> they leave him alone for the most part. Starla likes to bite at the, at the pieces of hay, but hopefully she'll grow out of that, and she'll leave him alone. So, yeah, so he's going to be standing in my Insola cook. <laughs> See, he stands on his own. He's gonna be in my entryway when you walk into my house. Super cute. Um, okay. So that's it for that's it for the 99 cent store. Um, oh, and I also got, I think I got a little headband with Medusa, like the little snakes. I just thought that was cute, and I told my husband I could totally throw that on and wear it to work because I like to dress up for work, but I like to do minimal. So I bought the Medusa crown because I figured they may not have that anymore the later if I wait till October and I've always wanted to go as Medusa so I got that okay so then we also checked out a Halloween store that's up here and I only bought one thing um, but at the Halloween store I got a little door it says it's a jointed cutout of um, a skeleton he's about four feet tall so he has joints he, his joints move and the reason why I bought him was because my mom has one of those vintage from the, the 70s. She has the larger skeleton. He's probably about maybe like five feet. He's probably as tall as me. Um, but he's like from the 70s. And so when you look at when you look those up on eBay, they're pretty pricey now. Um, and so of course, you know, this isn't gonna be the same good quality as hers, but she won't give him to me. I already asked her. I'm like, you don't even put up Halloween decor anymore. She's like, no, that's mine. So <laughs> So I got my own skeleton um, until she wants to give up her 1970s Halloween decor to me. Um, but I got him because I want to put him on our door. So I think I thought he was too cute. I, did, I just freaking love it. So and it was also kind of nostalgic for me because it did remind me of when I was a little girl. I loved the skeleton. So I would always tell my mom to let me put the skeleton up because I'd always like rearrange his arms and stuff different ways. And I don't know why, I just was one of those kids that loved Halloween all the time. And so, yeah. So the skeleton reminded me of my mom's, <laughs> of my mom's skeleton that she has. And so I'm like, I gotta, get, I gotta get him. So that was the only thing I purchased at the Halloween store. 
And then last but not least, my candles. So I had to put them in a bag because I didn't want to risk dropping them. Um, so when I was at Michael's, I had also got a candle. Michael's had a sale on their candles. They were like, I don't know. This one was priced at six bucks, but I got them for three, so he was half off. Um, this is um, it's Ashland brand, and it is cinnamon spice. Oh my God, like, you don't even have to open it. You could already smell him. But he's a purple color, single wick. Oh, smells like cinnamon. And so I'm like, this is gonna make my house smell so fall. And I love that it's a giant ass candle. Um, I just freaking love big candles. And I love when they have the strongest cozy scents. I'm telling you guys, like, like I like to have floral scents of candles in the, in the springtime. But as soon as we get into like fall time, I love like it's where it, you, you, it just smells like your house. You're baking something. <laughs> so cinnamon. I love it. Um, and then so that was the only candle I got at Michael's and he was three bucks. He was on sale. And then I was at Target another time. I'm this all this stuff wasn't on the same day. But mind you, OK, <laughs> um, so I was at Target another day, and of course, whenever I'm at Target, I gotta look at the candles. I've been buying like those religious candles because I light one a week for my husband. So I'm always in the candle aisle. And um, there was a freaking, uh, what do they call these? The wooden wicks, and these were on sale. So usually these are like $12, and this one was on sale. I think I only paid four bucks for him. He was on sale, and I'm like, why are you on sale? Like what's wrong with you <laughs> but he smells so good oh this scent is um apple leaf so it literally smells like an apple pie fucking delicious and the wick is wood so if you guys are not familiar the wooden wicks crackle okay and i only know this because when i i, I like to watch asmr videos to help me fall asleep and one of my favorite types of ASMR is the crackle candle videos. <laughs> so when they light the crackle candle, it just sounds so delicious. So I don't have a fireplace in my house. And so a crackle candle is gonna be the next best thing. They crackle and it's just, it's just the most delicious sound. And then the smell, oh my God. So, and then look at the color. Like my favorite color is green. So I just love that color. So cute. And it's by Nature's Wick. Natural candle with a wooden wick. Oh, it just got dark. <laughs> okay. And then yesterday, my husband, I had, I talked my husband into it. I was like, babe, can we go check out Bath and Body Works? And he's like, why? You, you have so many lotions. And I was like, because they have candles and they're on sale because of Labor Day weekend. And usually their candles are $24, but they were having a sale $10 off. So the candles were on sale for, t for 14 bucks. But... You also have, if you have a coupon, which I had a coupon online for an extra 20% off. So I got my candles for $11. $11 from 24 bucks a piece. Not bad. So <laughs> um, I got two of them because the total I paid for was 24 something. Pretty much one of these candles was free. The other one I paid $11 for. I mean, no, I paid $11 for both of them. But it was like getting one candle free. Does that make sense? Okay. So the the one that I wanted to get, like I didn't even know what it smelled like. It just sounds delicious. Um, is pumpkin cupcake. And so when I saw that one on the website and then I was watching candle haul videos, that's just my guilty pleasure. Like I love candles. So I was watching candle haul videos on YouTube and the girl had a fucking pumpkin cupcake candle and I was like, I need one of those. <laughs> so I figured if I go to Bath and Body yesterday, um, I figured if I if I was gonna just buy one candle, it was gonna be the, the pumpkin cupcake. And so here she is. Look at how cute. So nice chunky candle. And I love the little design on the front, super cute. And look at how cute the lid is, you guys. It has a little pumpkin. It says Bath and Body, and then it has a little pumpkin. Cute, right? Oh my God, it smells, it smells so good. And so it's a three wick candle. 
which I like three wick candles because then it, it burns the whole thing. Like sometimes if it's if the candle's too too wide and you only have one wick, it doesn't always burn all of the all of the wax, and then you're just like, oh, what a waste. So when it has three wicks, it's like for sure this whole baby is gonna burn, and and it's just stronger. Like the scent, like just radiates in your house. It smells. Oh, it just smells. <laughs> it smells like a pumpkin cake. Like like. It, like cake batter and pumpkin at the same time. Oh my God, it smells so good. <laughs> so I'm gonna light this sucker. I don't know when, I'm kind of like, I don't wanna light it because it's so cute, but I'm gonna light it. Like it's gonna smell so amazing in my house. And so then my husband's like, well babe, it's only 11 bucks, get another one. And I'm like, what? <laughs> can you say that again? So I can make sure you're being serious. And so he's like, he was like, get another one. And I'm like, okay. And he was the one that said, it's like you're, you're getting one free, so get another one. <laughs> so I ended up getting, we were literally walking through the whole store, smelling all of the different fall candles, and I fell in love with leaves. So this one's leaves. It doesn't have the cute top, but that's okay. Um, and it's scented candle made with essential oils. And let me see what... Crisp red apple, golden nectar, warm clove spice with essential oils. Oh my God. And it smells like fall. Oh, if I'm like putting it up to the camera as if you guys could smell it. It's a three wick candle too, but it's like if fall had a scent, this is it. It's like cinnamony with like pumpkin as if like you were baking something like kind of like the baking scent of this but with cinnamon, like red cinnamon, and then like a little bit of hint of pumpkin. And it just, oh my God, it just smells so good. So if fall had a scent, this is it. Um, and I really, really like, I don't think, oh yeah, this is a paper. Um, I really like the candles. Like you could use these to put your Q-tips in if you wanna recycle <laughs> after the candle is done. You could put your Q-tips in here, you could put loose change in here, you could put your little hair ties or your bobby pins in here, which is what I'm gonna do because I'm always losing mine. Um, you could put like your little makeup remover wipes in here, like those little, um, what are those fucking things called? Like the little pads. Um, you could put, what else could you put in here? You could put like, I don't know, pieces of makeup, like little eyeshadow things like you know like small small stuff you could put that in there you could put I don't know your oils like I have a lot of oils you could probably put them in here too but yeah so I like to recycle the jars for my candles especially when they're the big ones <laughs> and that's what I got you guys so I just wanted to show you guys my little haul, my fall haul. <laughs> there will probably be more um, of those coming because like I said, I love this time of year. And you can never have too many candles. I love to burn a candle all the time. So I usually always have one on, especially if I have guests over because I feel like it's just, it smells so good when you walk into the house and the first thing you smell is that candle going. <laughs> I think it's just a, an old habit because my dad would do the same thing. He would always have a candle going in the house. And so I just always remember growing up that house smelled so good all the time. Um, but anyways, you guys, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for being patient with me. I'm sorry I didn't put out a video diary yesterday, but I'm back and I will be back for more next week. Talk to you guys later. Bye my loves.